Hi there, this is Serwin and today I'm going to show you the best 10 CDR tweaks for iOS 7 for July 2014. Developers have released some great tweaks in the past month and I can't wait to share them with you. Let's move on to the first one, Dockware. iOS has a unique feature just like its older brother OS 10, and it is Dock where you can access your favorite apps quickly on every single page. However, you don't use Dock every time, so it's essential to have more space in home screen. Dockware gives iOS 7's Dock more power. Now, with that tweak, Dock can be used across any app, not only home screen. Also, you can hide it and access it only when you need it. Dockware integrated with Activator for picking a gesture to show your dock. You can configure more options in settings. The second one is Intube. We all watch YouTube videos on daily basis, whether it's for watching various videos or listening to music. But what if you have the ability to download those videos and watch them later when we are offline? Plus, importing them directly to music or videos app. Well, this is what Intube tend to do. By tapping Intube icon, which is appear when we are watching a video, you can download that video with desired quality. Also, there are more additional features such as download the video with the thumbnail and other informations, block ads, background playback for YouTube app and watch HD videos on 3G or 4G. The third one is Minimal Camera. Minimal Camera lets you toggle camera controls on or off in order to increase the view screen while you take a picture or record a video. To toggle camera controls, simply press and hold the screen until they are hidden or shown. And while controls are hidden, just tap to take a shot or record a video and swipe to access other camera features. The fourth one is Badge Boss. We all familiar with the red badge icons on apps which indicates newly incoming notifications since 2007. But with Badge Boss, you have the ability to customize the appearance of your badge to the color you want. Well, it's not all about color. There are more features. For example, you can hide the badge icon easily if you want to. You can also change badge number to something cooler. You can place the badge icon wherever you want not only on one corner. You can also change badge background color, font, size and so on. You can configure those options in settings. The other one is Notes Counter. Many of you use Notes app to write essays, lecture notes and other things. Let's say your essay limit is 1000 words. How do you know how many words have you written? Well, with Note Counter, you can enable this feature as you can see here. The other one is Quick Short Pro 2. It happens many times where we miss a moment because it takes some time to access the camera app. But Quick Short Pro 2 will ensure you never miss out a photo opportunity because it enables you to shoot or record a video directly from home screen. You can configure and activate a shortcut for them. The seventh tweak is Phantom for Snapchat. Nowadays, people tend to use Snapchat more often on daily basis. Though if you are a Snapchat user, you are aware of the limitation of that app. But with Phantom for Snapchat, you nearly break almost all of the limitation. For example, you can save sent snaps to your photos app, save received snaps and many more features as you will see when you use it. Are we on the same boat for having too many apps and can't find them easily in settings? If so, then you should get search settings, which enables search feature in settings. The ninth tweak is Volume Plus. With Volume Plus, you can add music controls to the volume HUD while music is playing. There is a grabber where you can reveal extra features such as sending a text and tap the album artwork or artist's name to open currently playing music. The last one, but not least, is Wall Cycler. With Wall Cycler, you will see new wallpapers every time you unlock your device. To do so, you should choose an album in wallpaper settings and this tweak will do the rest. 
as you can see here on this video. That was all guys for this month. I hope you have enjoyed this video and I suggest you to grab them as soon as you can. I have also reviewed some great tweaks for previous months. Please do check them out. I put the links in the description below and in the end of the video you can click on the smaller videos to open those reviews in a separate window. If you have any questions please do ask me and yep. Thanks for watching. Have a great time.